That's not I put on a cunt. No cap. 24 shows in a month. Good day that time it was crunch. Ice, diamonds is crushing. Louis V, but my t-shirt is tough. Yeah, cold as a slush. Belly rinse on, sipping a test. Go get it a must. Fuck a good in a pussy, no must. Love and I lust. My crew loyal, we trusted in us. Yeah. Money need up, and then she like they gun in the money. Yeah, look at that glitch, see what I mean. I gotta be facing, we picking green. Fuck on the neck, what's on the screen? Cross on the car, three care for the dreams. Feel like a punky, but you got my sleeve. I'm cool on you, drunk, I got no one to flee. I'm smoking inside to get don't got to see. Been in the roof, and I can feel the breeze. Packers got nachos, that's some chili cheese. Smoking gelato, got me feeling knees. My got that rolling for my oldest knees. I drop a hit, I'm knowing what they need. I check out the motor, got the hands on speed. I do it by focus, I can see the feed. Hey, you guys. I truly hope y'all can hear me because it's a thunderstorm going on outside, baby. Like, really? But anyways, I am back at it again with another video. And as y'all can tell by the title, we are going on a vacation. And I am super excited to be going on vacation. Y'all, I have been planning this trip since the beginning of this year. But I really, really been like packing my bags, getting my outfits and everything together since April. Because i just been so ready to like be on somebody's plane so i'm super excited um and y'all we are going to las vegas this is my first time going to vegas and we're going to see usher we are going to usher's residency me and erica so i am excited i got the fits i got the looks my bags are literally packed like they're packed and i'm ready to go today is actually friday july 7th um i'm about to go get a pedicure in my eyebrows wax i'm actually outside of starbucks i had pulled to the side really quickly i'm just trying to see if this rain is like going to settle down a little bit so i can order my drink because your girl is parched i'm a little thirsty as y'all can tell, I had already got my nails done on Wednesday. I wound up having to get my nails done a little bit early because Adina is going out of town this weekend as well. So, yeah, I love them. They're, like, so colorful, so abstract, and they're just giving me all the vibes. So, yes, I just wanted to come and say what's up and check in with y'all. I know I've been gone for, like, a little minute but honestly i really just needed time to like just be in my zone some days like i just really didn't feel like recording and editing y'all know i work a nine to five your girl is a regular regular girl with a full-time job i'm also in college still just furthering myself and furthering my education so i just need some time to really just be because I just really didn't feel like recording on the weekends. Like, it, it's no excuse, but I just really didn't feel like doing it. But, you know, I'm back. I'm feeling better than ever. I'm feeling motivated to find more of a balance in my life. So, yeah, just wanted to check in with y'all, say what's up. Also, I want to give a shout out to all my new subscribers. Y'all, we are a family of 700 plus subscribers, so I'm definitely super excited about that. Thank you all so much for subscribing to my channel. Thank you all to all the returning subscribers who always like view my videos, watch my content, leave me comments, leave me likes. I definitely appreciate it. Like, I truly appreciate it. But you guys, we're gonna wait to see if this rain calms down. But either way it goes, I have my um, pedicure at four o'clock. I am a little bit early because I really wanted to go to TJ Maxx as well. But I don't know if I'm gonna get out of my car. So we'll see. But I'll check back in with y'all a little bit later if anything goes down. I got my Starbucks. The rain has calmed down, so let's go inside the TJ Maxx. And if y'all want to know what this is, it's a venti chai tea latte ice with matcha cold foam. Let's go inside the TJ Maxx.
Y'all, I literally just got out of TJ Maxx. I have to rush to my nail appointment. Not really because it's in the same plaza, but I'm so sad right now. So I found so many earrings while I was in there. I'm going to give y'all a haul um, once I get back home because I don't have time to do like a car haul. But I found so many cute earrings while I was in there. And unfortunately, the ones that I really, really liked wind up breaking on me because they got stuck inside of the cart. And I was trying to get them out and I got them out, but they wind up breaking because it was like a drop down like flower earring and the hook that connects the like earrings together broke off and that was the only one that they had and they had like some similar styles on Shein because the line was so long in there I was just trying to see if I could like maybe find them online and they had some similar styles on Shein but Honestly, like soon as I leave from getting my um pedicure, I'm about to go to like two more TJ Maxx's to see if I can find that earring because I'm so disappointed. And I really, really want that earring. I actually found the earring on eBay. Like somebody was selling it on eBay, but I'm not paying $35 when it was only $12.99 inside of TJ Maxx. So I'm gonna have to just be on a hunt between like Marshalls and TJ Maxx to see if I can find it and um if I can't find it then I'm gonna just have to maybe just get the sheet in version because um yeah I'm like low-key sad right now, but I hope I find them. But at this time, I'm about to just try to find some parking and I'm about to just go inside of my nail appointment. So I will check back in with y'all a little bit later. So I just finished getting my pedicure, you guys. My toes look amazing. Anna always does her thing. Like, my eyebrows look too good. So now I'm about to go to the bank. I'm about to give me something to eat. And then I'm about to go home. And you guys, I found the earrings on Shein. Literally found them on Shein. If I would have purchased them, if they did not break, they would have been like $12 and some change. But I found them on Shein for like two dollars and some change so of course i ordered them because i'm obsessed like i'm gonna insert a picture for y'all because they're just so cute different so yeah i'm so happy that i found them on shein but anyway you guys i'm gonna um see you guys once i get home all right y'all so i'm back home i just wanted to show you guys really quickly before i shower and get even more settled in what i got from when I tell y'all I just got so many earrings like I'm obsessed like lately I've just been really obsessed with like very gaudy extra type earrings okay so I got these right here hopefully my camera focuses these are such a beauty. They're by Betsy Johnson. And they were $14.99. I just love like the extraness of the strawberries. Like I just think these are so cute. 
I got these by Happily Gray. These were $14.99 as well. So cute. <laughs> I got another pair by Happily Gray. These were $12.99. So cute. These are by the brand Natasha. These were $12.99. Just like a textured half hoop earring. Then I got these by Bessie Johnson as well. These were $12.99. So cute. Very like Caribbean vacay vibes. Love it. Then these are by House of um, Harlow 1960. I really love this brand um, at TJ Maxx. This was $12.99. This is how they look. These were $12.99. Y'all, let me pop another battery inside of this camera and I'll be right back. All right, y'all, I'm back. These earrings right here are so cute. These are by the Natasha brand. They were $12.99. Just these like cute little butterfly drop earrings. Now, I believe this is maybe called Gemily. I'm not sure, but these were $12.99. I actually already own a pair like this, but they are much smaller. So this is like a bigger version. So cute. Then I got these earrings by Robert Lee Morris. They actually were on clearance for $10, but I think they have them marked originally for $12.99. So saved a few coins. And these are just like a large hoop earring. And then I wind up getting some Dippity Do um, shampoo as well as conditioner. as well as a deep treatment and then i got the gelay and i also got this isaac mazari um manicure manicure kit to put in my purse and it was 4.99 is it isaac mazari Honestly, I don't know how to say that. But yeah, this was the Dippity Do. This is the treatment. This was $4.99. The Gelay or Gel was $5.99. The Curl Shampoo was $9.99. And then the Curl Conditioner was $9.99 as well and honestly I got this because of TikTok because I see that it works wonders on 4C hair so I definitely just want to give it a try on my hair just to see you know how it works out but those are all the items <laughs> those are all the items that I got today from um TJ Maxx so far as my maintenance we actually are basically done with everything um tomorrow I was gonna go to the hair salon to get my hair washed conditioned and braid it down so that I can install my wig but Honestly, it would have been my first time going to this individual and I confirmed online I didn't have to pay a deposit, but I really wanted to call in advance to make sure like I knew where I was going and like that she had me truly confirmed, but there was like no working numbers. So I just decided to like cancel that appointment and so I'm just going to let my mom braid my hair down because she used to braid my hair down back in the day. And then I also... Just want to go to the liquor store as well as to um, get some little snacks for me and Erica because our flight is on Monday. And I kind of made these like little girl trips bag um, more so for Erica than me. Like I ordered myself a bag as well. So I got this bag that says girls trip Las Vegas 
2023 and i put like a bunch of different stuff um inside of it so i also got this cup as well i was backwards i also got this cup as well and then it has erica's name on the bag i got me a cup in a bag as well and then i put some makeup remover inside of it just a whole bunch of like different stuff i got some flushable wipes as well as like some um purell wipes i got a lysol hand sanitizer I got tissue, got some gum, I got this disposable seat cover, and I also got these like, what are these? These are like um, those towelettes that you go wet and then you can just wipe your face off. I got these. I actually got like some soap. This is like sheet soap. Um, some chapstick. I got her some lotion. And then I got her a fan. And then I also got her some little mask stuff that she could do. So yeah, like all I need to add to it is just like a little alcohol shooter and then just like some little snacks or whatever and yeah so super excited but i'm gonna call it a night good morning beautiful people excuse the basic appearance it is the day before we leave i am currently headed to the liquor store dollar tree and then to Publix. So just running some small quick errands and then once I get back home, um, I'm going to start customizing my wig. I already set out the supplies and everything. So yeah, I just wanted to stop by, say good morning and y'all will catch me inside of the store. I wish I had my camera out when this man first opened the door and said welcome because it very much was giving alcoholic vibes because who comes and gets alcohol at like 10 o'clock in the morning? <laughs> I am ashamed. I wanted to get like the small little Casamigos bottles but he was out of it so I just got like the small Don Julio and then like this small um get me so yeah we have secured the alcohol now i am going to go secure the snack all right you guys let's do a small dollar tree haul i went a little crazy some of the stuff is not even like trip related starting with the snack so I got this for me. I love like cheese and caramel popcorn. I got this popcorn for Erica. These are like the kettle corns because I'm not sure what vibe she on. Like I don't know if she on a healthy vibe or like, so I got a mixture of stuff for her. I got these garlic Parmesan um, pretzel crisps for myself. Um, I got these sour punch straws. I got one for Erica and one for myself. So, I got two Hershey's cookies and cream. One for me, one for Erica. I feel like everybody should love those. I got the vanilla Oreos for myself. Um, I got the just original Oreos for Erica because I'm not really sure which one she likes. I got the Garditos for myself. I love these, especially these like little crisps. And then I got Erica this beef jerky because she said that she liked that. I got this like little craft scraper. I saw this girl on TikTok talk about how she uses these to like get gel and like different products out of her bottles. So I thought that was smart. 
I just got this jar because I've been making this like Indian hair oil and I just needed another jar to put everything in. And then I purchased some more like little organizers. I use this for my jewelry. I got this like little detangling brush to put inside of my purse. Um, I just needed like a smaller one. I got these little sticky notes because when I get back from Vegas, I'm going to be doing like a little solo date jar. So I got these for that. I got the jar that I'm going to put the sticky notes in. I got this little coin pouch. It was at the register. This little coin pouch. And then I also got these pistachios for Erica as well. So that is all that I got from the dollar store. Let's run to Publix really quickly and head back inside. All right, y'all. I am back home. I want to show y'all the final product of the girls' trip bag. It's so, so cute. And it has, like, everything stuffed inside of it. I had basically already showed y'all everything that I bought to put inside of it. But these are the snacks and stuff like that. So, yeah. You can see I am installing my wig. It's about, like, 1040. So, I decided to just go ahead and install my wig. Y'all, like, I'm loving this hair color on me. It looks so good. I really wanted to take my time to install my wig so i started a little bit early i use the ors um olive oil products so first i did with the wig grip gel and then once i had the lace like smashed in with my um comb like i went on top of the lace with that and then i put my melt band so then after that i'm gonna cut it with these scissors and then go back in with like a little bit of makeup and then seal it in with this super hold spritz but i'm just doing like a glueless method because i really don't prefer to sleep in my wigs so yeah i got all of my supplies and everything already packed and then um i also have a backup wig as well that's like a black wig which is also curly also and I kind of, um, I didn't customize it all the way, but I did just make sure that the lace was tinted and then I put like my makeup and stuff in it already. So if I do decide to like switch out my wig sometime during the trip, that's already together. So yeah, but I'm hoping to like just wear this one throughout the trip, but I love this color. I love the curls. I may or may not wet it again. I like that like puffy curly look. So we'll see. Y'all, please ignore this clothing rack. Like, these are outfits for my next vacation. <laughs> so, this is what we're working with today. Something super chill, super comfy. Jean jacket. Y'all seen this jacket so many times. This is from Rainbow. The jumpsuit is from Old Navy. Shoes are Gucci. I got these from the outlet in the men's section. And these are just so cute. Just a cute little Gucci dad slide. And then, yeah, this is my outfit. Jewelry, I have on these like bamboo knockers that I got from Shein. Bracelets from Shein. Necklace. I think I got this at um, Target. It just says Aquarius. And then, of course, I have on my rings that I always wear and my Apple Watch. So, this is my outfit. And then, airport bag, I am carrying my large tail feezy. Like, it fits so much stuff. so cute y'all it is hot out here we had to make a very quick pit stop to the beauty supply store because i needed to just grab another mail bin because i have one in my luggage but i probably should have just bought another one from home or just like kept it on until i got to my destination so now we are headed to um erica's hopefully she's back home because she said she has to go to the bank but yeah it's hot it's hot out here. I got a little sweat stain under my boobs. <laughs> like I had to put my hair up, which I need to fix it a little bit better. I came aside to give Erica her girl's trip bag, but also just like fix my hair because I had to put it in a clock clip. When I tell y'all it's hot, 
it is hot. But um, our flight is actually delayed. So we will be sitting at the airport for a little bit. Unfortunately for us, we have a connecting flight that's supposed to depart at 827. So I'm hoping that we could run to the next gate. Um, because we're literally only going to have like a little small time. Like the flight departs at like six something. Um, it doesn't land until 815. The next flight departs at 827. And it says gate B12. We're coming into gate C. So I'm hoping like I've been to the Charlotte airport before. So I'm hoping it's just like easy breezy. Um, yeah. So I'm a little nervous right now. Around here we pop them cars. Around here we get them dogs. Every girl I see that look right like me just got a hop. This kid here all about stacking up. Call big here, but we can back it up. Long as everybody get pumped and they drop in the clubs all acting up. I represent the S-O, S-O, D-E-F-M-O-B. That's me, J-D. Y'all. So we made it to the airport. I used my TSA pre-check for the first time. It was very convenient. The alcohol made it through with no issues. Me and Erica are about to go find something to eat because they didn't take it. Oh, okay. I didn't even think I forgot. <laughs> Me and Erica got through with no issues. But the problem now that we're having is our flight will now be leaving at seven o'clock instead of six. We're gonna miss our connecting flight to Vegas. <sighs> this is unfortunate.